disconnect from the vehicle. And Yay! Oh my god, we're going! Holy cow! Okay, all right. We are at T minus 31, 31 seconds. seconds. And it is super foggy. Oh my gosh, yes, I just saw it come in. Thank you so much for a $40 donation. Thank you. That goes direct to me. So thank you so, so, so much. Good T minus 15. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my gosh. It's happening, you guys. It's happening. Eight, seven, seven, six, five, five four, four, three, three two, two, one. Oh my God. It's going. Go, go, go. Oh my gosh. Go, 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 go. Hop, hop. Hop, 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 go, go, go! Where's the camera feed? Oh, there it is! Oh my gosh, it's going! Ah! I was at SN10. Oh my gosh, it's going, you guys. This is crazy. So now we know that they can launch in fog. This is very exciting. Three seconds. Starship test vehicle number 11 ascending over Starbase in South Texas. Wow! Hi, Derek Richardson. We've got Nikola Tesla's ghost with an emoji. Yaz, Vladimir, Tamar, Aaron. Up. We're over one kilometer up. Views from the external camera on Starship number 11 looking back towards the Starbase facility in the fog in South Texas. That's crazy. Wow, Aaron says it's the first time he's seen that view. Nice view, oh my God, despite the foggy. Yes, isn't that cool? I'm surprised too, Tamar, oh my gosh. I think that they probably, he was just so frustrated with the FAA stuff. He, they were like, we're just going, we're going, we're going. Okay, I'm gonna sit back down. Oh my gosh. Oh my God, oh my God. I can't even hear it. Can you guys hear it? Oh, I've got noise canceling headphones on. Ha 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 ha. Tom, hi Tom Kaputa. Wow, yes. Burning gems. Hi, I see you there. Hello. Is, is that Jana? Okay, we are at one minute. T plus one minute and 59. T plus two minutes. We're two getting minutes. ready to shut down the first of the three Raptor engines. Oh, come on. Hi, Angelo M. Four kilometers says Paul Kelly. I love how it shakes like that. Like shake it, shake, shake it, shake that Raptor. Shake it like a Raptor engine. Shake T plus it. Two minutes, 21 seconds. We have shut down the first of the three engines on time as planned. Yeah. Victory, 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 victory. It's our time. Ba -da 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 -ba 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 -ba. I was a cheerleader. Looking great. Still surprised they went for it. Moi aussi, Tamar, or Tamar. Moi aussi. Shake those raptors. Shake those tail feathers. Shake your tail feather. Da -na 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 -na. It's 6.03 a.m. and I can't believe how much excitement I have squeezed out of myself. I'm not a morning person. T plus three minutes continuing to climb on power of two engines. We're past eight kilometers. Whoo. Oh no, no, no. Go away. There we go. Sorry, everybody. Okay. Look at that. Okay, so we were waiting for it to reach its highest ascent which should be right around 10 kilometers, unless they go take that, you inspector, says Two plus Tomorrow. three and a half minutes. You can see with the camera view, we have shut down the second of the three engines as planned. We're now slowly climbing to the final 10 kilometer altitude on the power of the single Raptor engine. They're losing Once we're at feed, Apogee, see how it's we'll still going? shortly, shut down the engine as we flip over and then descend back towards the landing pad at Starbase. This is not my feed, you guys see this? See how it's still counting? This is this is SpaceX. Altitude. Coming up at T plus four minutes, we're at 10 kilometers altitude, and we are getting dropouts on the camera. Uh, we continue to get to limit uh, 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 from the Starship vehicle. Boo. It's okay. It can't be perfect every time, right? Oh, come on. Show us the vehicle. 
Show us. While we're the... waiting to reestablish video connection with the vehicle. We have shut down the third of the three Raptor engines as planned. We're now beginning the horizontal maneuver back down. Are you to kidding the... me? Yeah. Come on, bring Start it back. back. As we get close oh to land, my God. the three Raptor engines. There we go. The Woo! Vehicle, and then land on the thrust of a single Raptor engine. T plus four minutes, 40 seconds and counting, and it looks like we've got some camera views back again. Oh my gosh, please don't drop out again, please. Please. Woo, look at that. You just gotta, just gotta get above the clouds. Altitude. Woo, 10. Or nine. Look at that, beautiful. T plus five minutes, we're passing through five kilometers, a nice view from the exterior camera, showing one of the flaps Yay! on the Starship. Hi, Hi Caleb. I love the big smile. I loved your your comment on my video last night. Stop making me smile. That was funny. You got power off for three minutes. Oh my gosh. This isn't. All right. So it is right now the vapor. As far as I know, it is um, not dumping fuel like locks to try to. Uh, it's expelling. Some of the fuel mixture. One kilometer altitude. T plus 545. We've just passed through one kilometer altitude. Getting ready for the relay. Oh, it's coming down. It's coming down. Oh, shh. Come on. Land. Oh. Land. Did it land? Did it land? Did it land? Sounded like a crash. Did it land? No! I heard a crash. Did it crash? No! No! Oh my gosh. What? happened uh, uh, come on spacex you did it on sn10 oh my god nikola tesla's ghost has a cry emoji weeping oh my god what happened Oh man, what takes the wind out of my sails? We're back with you. As you can see from the uh, frozen camera view, uh, we lost the clock at T plus 5 minutes 49 seconds. Looks like we've had another exciting test of Starship number 11. A reminder again, this is a test series to gather data on entry of the Starship vehicle uh, at subsonic speeds as it comes back to the landing zone. It does appear, though, that uh, another exciting test, as we say. Uh, we don't have any good camera views to share with you right now. So with that, we are going to bring the webcast to a close. Uh, we, a quick recap, we had the nominal ascent. We maneuvered the horizontal when we got to 10 kilometers. Mm -hmm. The entry, we had some nice views from the exterior camera showing uh, the flaps were quiet as we descended. But then we had the camera freeze up as we got into the engine ignition sequence. And so we're going to have to find out from the team what happened. But with that, we'd like to thank the team and bring the webcast to a close. And we'll be back with you with Starship, the next Starship test in the near future. Um, what a bummer. Wah, 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 wah. Yeah. I really thought that they would get it this time. In the air? Oh, did the flight termination system? And for those uh, who just joined us, uh, uh, the frozen view we saw on the camera doesn't mean that we are waiting for the signal to come back. Starship 11 is not coming back. Don't wait for the landing. Uh, we do appear to have lost all the data from the vehicle and the team of course uh, is away from the landing pad so we'll be out there uh, seeing what we had please follow us on social media for updates but with that we are going to bring the webcast to a close 
interesting flight, and as always with Starship, an exciting time on our webcast. Thank you for tuning in today. Yeah, you're right. Nick, mainstream media will probably blame Tesla Autopilot. I wonder if they were testing out the flight termination system. What do you guys think? The explosives on the side. Oh, my God. What a freaking bummer. Parts were falling out of the sky. Man, it takes a lot to disappoint me. And I'm not disappointed at SpaceX. Like, they did the best that they could. But so much pressure. Like Aaron said up there, too much pressure for this launch. Getting text messages. Oh, man. What a bummer. Hey, Jess, that was a good show you put on 